Hi guys, this is just a quick tutorial video on how to make a jetty transmitter work with Aki RC on Steam. As you can see, the transmitter is turned off, so if I power on the transmitter, I've created a model for Aki RC. Uh, if I click menu, go down then to system, and down near the bottom, USB, click that. It'll say you can connect the cable. If you want to double check, click here where the spanner icon is. And you can see then here joystick and mass storage. So we can go ahead and connect the transmitter to the mini USB cable. Okay, that's that connected. Let's see if we can we'll switch on RC as well. So I have Steam open, click play. No, it didn't like the way it turned off the transmitter the last time. Okay, so I have the transmitter set up. You could go in here to transmitter and double check. You can see here it's highlighted for Jetty USB. Uh, you can do all your calibration and your setup here. Hopefully this will work okay. Um, we're going to click fly and if all works correctly we should have a Goblin 770. Okay, here we go. Uh, uh, sorry, I'll turn on some volume. I, I have set my idle up positions on this switch here. Because that, that's where I like them on my own transmitter. So, one, two, and three. And if we give it a bit of pitch. There we go. Uh, very, very hard to steer or control the helicopter, obviously, like this. So. I think we'll bring it back. Hopefully set it down with a record. Thanks very much.